What is up you guys? It is... Well, by the time you're seeing this, I'm currently on a plane to Hawaii right now. Um, I'm actually going to Hawaii to meet up with Sawyer, Sam Evans, and possibly some other people that I don't even know about right now. So I figured, while I'm on this plane, I would have this video upload for you guys. And uh, just so I could give you guys a little more information about my life and uh, a little more backstory about me. So I figured, here's 25 things that you may or may not know about me, but 25 things that you should know. To start off, my full name is Cody Allen Buffington. I was born August 14th, 1994. Italian food is by far my most favorite food. My number one goal in life right now is to travel to every single country in the world. Okay, Google says there's 196 countries, so I have many more to go to, but that is my number one goal in life right now. I have lived in this beautiful state of Connecticut all of my life. For my uh, whole 22 years, I've lived in Connecticut. The video game Halo has always been my best game, the, the game that I excel at. And when I was younger, I wanted to be a professional Halo player and be MLG. <laughs> As some of you may know, I am actually deathly allergic to peanuts, uh, but something you may not know is that I'm also allergic to the metal nickel. For some reason, the metal nickel, I don't know. I met all of the exploring crew in 2015. I actually have two other YouTube channels, one that I started in 2005 and one that I started in 2011. In 2005, I started making vlogs. And it was actually just like really crappy little vlogs. Actually, hold on. I actually made the vlogs on this little, uh, what is it? A Kodak Easy Share point and shoot camera. It's just a very simple camera. It took AA batteries. So I, I remember me and my friends, we used to always have to carry tons and tons of AA's in our pockets because we'd actually be vlogging much like we're doing now, but you know, a lot less professional. But we'd always have to carry AA's in our pockets and it got to the point where I had to like buy a bunch of rechar rechargeable double A's and I'd charge like eight batteries every night. It was, uh, <laughs> it was wild times back in 2005. I got my first DSLR camera, which is the Canon T4i, when I graduated from high school. It was a gift actually, and uh, it was the first real DSLR camera I had and I love this thing so much. I went to community college for two years to study uh, TV and film. But I stopped going to school after that so I could shoot commercials, DJs, weddings, and all that. When Josh and I each had about 2,000 subscribers, I saw a video of his, and I actually messaged him on Facebook to hang out and go and explore an abandoned building. After that one time that we hung out, we, uh, we went and planned a trip to Thailand for 30 days that night. I took a lot of photography and film classes in high school, and during lunch I would actually go down into the TV studio and practice editing on the computers and watching tutorials on YouTube on how to get better at editing. In high school, I actually did pretty well. I actually took some honor classes, I took a few AP classes, and I ended up with a 3.8 GPA, which is not bad. And, uh, you know, I applied to all these Ivy League, like, top film schools. I didn't get into any of them. And uh, it's kind of better off that I didn't. So it all worked out, really. <laughs> I'm pretty grateful that I didn't get into any of the film schools. I would have spent so much money and uh, I'm much happier doing what I'm doing now. For as long as I can remember, since I was about 10 or 11, I used to always film little skits with my friends. And uh, you know, I was 11 shooting on this little point and shoot camera, but I would have a tripod and I would set up these stupid little skits. They're actually on YouTube and they're in about 144p resolution. So you can barely even make out our faces, but I used to always film things. I still do now, I've always had a camera in my hand. When I was the age of 11 through 14, I wanted to be an actor and I would actually go into New York uh, multiple times a week. I would get pulled out of school, which was amazing. In the middle of the day, I'd just get randomly pulled out because uh, my mom would uh, get calls from our agent, my agent, and uh, I would have to go into New York for the day to do an audition. So that was a really fun time in my life, going to New York like multiple times a week to do auditions. But I always wanted to be an actor when I was about age 11 to 14. From the age of 16 to 19, I actually worked at a gas station, which really sucked. And uh, I just saved up enough money to buy myself a camera. I bought the uh, the Canon 5D. I saved up for this camera right here, which is my more professional shooting camera. This is the camera that I then use to shoot weddings, DJs, you know, concerts, pretty much everything I use to shoot uh, with this thing. I saved up money for working at a gas station. When I was 16, I went on a school trip with a group of friends to Italy, where I actually just 
got my like first like kind of real-ish camera. It wasn't a DSLR, but it was a more professional camera. I don't actually have it anymore. But that's where I started taking, uh, you know, pictures, travel pictures, and that's where my love of travel came from. And uh, I can't wait to actually go back to Italy now and take much better pictures, because the ones that I have back then, eh, they're not so good. I didn't even really know how to take a picture. I did my first skydive on my 17th birthday, and I actually got my skydiving license when I turned 20. Also for a while, I wanted to be a DJ, because just being a DJ just seemed so cool. I got the programs and everything, but I found out that you have to know at least a little bit about music, and I really was not interested in learning the whole music theory, chords, and all that, and you really do need like a basic knowledge of music to be any kind of musician, DJ, or whatever, and I just wasn't interested in that. I just wanted to play the shows. Funny enough, before I started doing YouTube, and uh, really even watching YouTubers, my friend recommended me to watch this uh, channel. It was called Sawyer Hartman, and he was doing short films, and I was doing short films, so that's the reason he told me to watch this guy. And here I am now on a plane to go see Sawyer Hartman and hang out in Hawaii for the week. For a while, I was really obsessed with collecting as much licenses as I could, and really just becoming well-rounded. So I got my boating license, my snowmobile license, and my skydiving license. I wanted to get a bunch more, but uh, I kind of grew out of that. I actually do really want to go into space. Not only do I want to see every single country on Earth, I also want to go into space. And lastly, I have actually crashed a motorcycle, and I do have a scar on my knee from that crash, and uh, I don't have a motorcycle anymore. <laughs> so that has been the 25 things about me. I hope you guys learned something new. I don't think I've shared all of these facts in my videos. Tomorrow should be picking up in Hawaii. I can't wait for you guys to see this beautiful island. I can't wait to see it myself. I'm, I'm coming here in the dark, so I'm not going to see it until really the next day in the morning. But uh, until next time, I will see you guys later.